Hey there, it's me Red Knight and welcome back to my channel for a Heyday Maggie video. Now there's been quite a few questions in the community about Maggie, so I'm just going to answer some of those before she actually disappears and we lose the chance to get the deco. Now first of all, this is a capsule event. Now the item in the capsule is the paintbrush. Now you don't actually get the paintbrush, it's just an image. The key focus within the actual game itself is to change all of our house trucks and roadside stall designs so they look like Greg's which is the birthday theme design. Now if you go back to your farm as an example you'll notice that there is no design there. You'll look around and you think okay how do I do this? Well you've got to go to Maggie. Now when you go to Maggie and you look in the collection book you'll see that there's those pre-existing designs ready there waiting for us. So Maggie will then come. If she's not there, don't worry, just tap on the house if you haven't already done so by now. And then basically those designs should pop up with an option. You've got the three tabs at the top there, which is what you're actually looking at. So once Maggie's actually there, or you just go to your house, you'll see the tabs will be highlighted like this, and then there will be the three styles. Now what you need to do is literally just tap on each of the styles that you want to install from this book. Now it does tell you that once you install these styles you can't change it. But don't worry about that, it's actually not true and I'll show you at the end of the video that if you don't want to keep this design you can actually revert it back to another one once you've actually purchased it. Now I don't like to change my designs that often, um, especially for themes but when Maggie does come every time, I tend to buy new designs because I like to complete my book. So here you can see me buying all of the designs that are necessary. Now I'm lucky with this farm, I have all the resources. With my other farms, I don't necessarily have the resources. I might be a few diamonds short, but that's not a problem. I can do mining activities, I can do the events that give diamonds, I can look in some of the chests both on my farm or in the actual town area. Maybe some of the thresholds for the activities that we're doing, like this beautiful town event, will give me diamonds as well, thus allowing me to purchase these designs. Now, once you've got them there, you might think, okay, I don't want to keep this one, I want to revert it back. So as you can see there, I've got my gorgeous... Um, Halloween design there and I love that one a lot I really really do now I come to my collection book and you can see down I don't have many styles with this farm which is not a problem but I do like that one now that image that you just looked at is very key now as you can see here what I would do I would go through normally I would install these three designs that I like there uh, I build the designs like normal then the, the resources come out of my account and the design is now changed boom 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 and Maggie's done I then go back to my actual book itself and each of those three icons are now added to my collection book. I can't do any more installations as you can see them, but they are now in the book. Now let's just say I want to revert it back. Now you saw that there were no initial designs or options available, but if you see here I can highlight the one I want to do. It tells me the reduced price for redoing it. I click on yes I want to do it and then it says build again, I say build again and then basically it reverts it back. So this is the way you can actually change it. So if you've got a design that you purchase for an event, you decide you don't want it, you go into the collection book, slide along to the design that you want, see how much they're charging, say build again, then build again, it converts it to the new design that you would like and hey presto it's done and dusted. I hope you like it. Right, that's Maggie with the answers explained. Now, if you've got any questions, you're welcome to come and ask me. Uh, all you need to do as well is post comments on my videos down below. Now, as you know, I am a content creator as per some of the other creators. If you want to use my code, please do so. It's R3DKNIGHT. It's also my 50th birthday coming up very soon in July. So why not send me a beautiful postcard or even a birthday card? You don't have to send me a present, but it would be nice to see something from you. You've also got the option to subscribe to my channel. My channel's free to join. Okay, a lot of you watch my videos, but don't hit the button. So why not press that button and watch the other videos? But either way, I'll see you next time. If you've got any more questions, let me know and I'll ask as best as I can. Bye now.